Hello guys. Welcome to fifth session of Razor View Engine Tutorials. Till now we are simply declared variables and printed. Now we will use blocks like if, switch, while, for, for each. To define block we need to use at sign followed by curly braces just like above block. Let's define variable in this block. Number equals to 10. Let's create if block and check whether number is odd or even. If number modulo 2 equals equals 0 then we are going to print number is even. Else number is odd. View in browser. It prints even. If we change value to 11 it will obviously print odd. Let's comment this and use switch case statements instead of if else block. At sign switch within parenthesis pass number. Use case statements. Write case 10 colon and print its 10 by using at sign followed by colon. And break statement. Let copy this case statement for more options. Paste it and change values to 20. And for 32. I know it's not proper way to check value of variable. But in this session we will learn its syntax in Razor. Let use while loop to print all number from 10 to 1. First of all we need to comment switch case statement by pressing Ctrl K, C. Write at sign within parenthesis check whether no is greater than equals to 1. Then we need to print number itself and decrement number by using number minus minus statement. View in browser. It print all of the numbers in same line to print all in new line we need to use br tag fhtml. We can also define out variable here too. It's not necessary to define in starting of page. For that we need to create a new block by using at curly braces. Within that var list of numbers equals to new integer array with initializer block contains some values such as 10, 20, and 30. For using for each loop we need to write at sign for each within parenthesis write var n in list of numbers. And print number and br tag. Let's see what we are learn in this session. We can define block of code in Razor by using at sign followed by curly braces. In parenthesis write any C-sharp valid statements. In this example we are used if statement in code block. For only switch case statement use same syntax as C-sharp with prefix at sign on switch. We can also put entire switch statement in code block like if statement. Like switch we can also use loops with only at sign. We can also use HTML tags in this way. Note that to change value of variable we does not need to use at sign. We can also define variables like this way. We just need to note that where we need to write at sign or not. Similar to while loop we can use for each loop too. Thanks for watching have a nice day.